For a single point charge, we have an equation to calculate the potential it creates around it. Knowing the point charge's charge, we can measure what the potential is at any point r meters away from it. So great, for one charge we can calculate the potential anywhere. But what about two charges? Well this is where the superposition principle comes into play. What this principle implies is that you can separately calculate the potential made by each point charge and add it up. At point A, I am distance R1 from charge 1, so I can plug that in to get the potential made by charge 1. But I'm also near charge 2, so I plug in Q2 and the distance from point A to charge 2, which I've labeled as R2, into the equation. So if I know the potential created by charge 2 and charge 1, all I have to do is add it together to figure out the potential for my system. But this isn't just limited to two point charges. We can do it for three, four, five, and onward to infinity. As long as you account for the amount of charge present and the distance to each charge, you'll be able to calculate the electric potential at any point.